Fire Shard, Frost Shard, Thunder Shard. Potions. Uh, let's get about let's max. Let's go to thirty. High potion. Let's go to thirty. Phoenix down. Let's go to ten. For the needles, I'm not gonna worry about maiden's kiss. I'm not gonna worry. About. I guess we go to five of these just in case you never know. Eye drops, uh, let's go to 10, just round it off, antidote, only one, a tent, let's get four of these suckers. Right, we've already stayed at the end, but let's see if there's anything in the end we need to take a look at. Gah! What are you thinking, sneaking up, uh, uh, sneaking up behind an old man like that? Shoo! Go find your own spot. Shoo, fly, shoo. You'll rest your armor swimming around in it like that. Oh, you startled me. Joining us for a swim? Have you ever heard of Whisperweed? It's a plant that you can use to throw your voice really far. At least that's what I heard. You got any Whisperweed? Wait, there was something over here. Ether. But no Whisperweed. Wait. There was something. Something over here. Wait, come on, dude. Where the hell? Wait. Right. Dry ether. Huh. I don't know what does dry ether do. Look at our inventory. Let's sort. Dry ether restores a hundred magic points as opposed to regular ether, which only restores fifty. It sucks I have not found a shop where you could actually buy ether. Alright, I managed to get a seat at the table today. Drink up, sir. 
I've every intention of living another 40 years. I'll take this place over heaven any day of the week. Oh, Stella, how I love you. Hey, wait a minute. Stella? You're not really a woman, are you? Oh my, you're a cute one, aren't you? Why don't you let Stella here get a closer look at you? Hmm. What say you young fella spend a few hours with me? I'll show you a good time. Come on, don't give me that face. Eesh. Well, hello, young sir. If there is anything I can do for you, please don't hesitate to ask. I trust you've a full purse, sir. Nothing comes cheaply up here. No matter how many times I visit this place, I never tire of the ladies. They're truly top class. Members only. Come on now, get out. Of course, anything to buy your love, my sweet. Next time I want furs, and nice ones, too. Nothing cheap. Ah, I love this place. The air is sweet, the food sweeter, and I feel so at ease with all the other girls about. How dare that greasy old gray beard try to take my Jennifer. Jennifer. Oh, I need to go get the food from downstairs. And seeing my chance, I thrust my blade into the goblin's heart, putting an end to his foul ways for good and all. Hey, can I talk to the girl? No, she can't talk to the girl. This old geezer won't stop rambling on about his battle stories, I swear. But I have to hear about one more stupid goblin. I wonder why I actually need to buy that pass. I'm not buying that freaking pass to come up here. I'll do it later if I have to. May I see your member's writ? I'm not spending a hundred grand, ten thousand freaking jill on something. I don't know what it's gonna do. It's like I could save the game and go back. I could. Ah. Will you please stop pestering me? Can't you see I'm sunbathing? Seriously. Seriously. Not long ago, I ventured out to the cave on the island to the northeast, prospecting for gems. The iron strongbox I carried jumped right out of my hand and stuck to the cavern floor. Couldn't budge it for all I tried. Oh, where has that old husband of mine gone off to this time? I think he's at the pub, the lady. Black Jacobo Nursery. Our rich soil and ample waters allow us to raise a variety of crops. And growing fresh greens allow us to raise hardy Jacobos in turn. Or Chocobos. Black Chocobo Nursery. Chocobos are cute. They're a little stinky, though. I want to fly on a black Chocobo, but they always get mad when I try to get too close. I don't think they like me. Probably never encountered one of these before, eh? Black Chocobos. Them flyers. These ones here are farm rays. They can't fly like the pharaohs. Find, find one of the wild ones in the woods up north, though, and you'll see. It's a sight to behold, a black chocobo in flight. Not the highest of flyers, but they get around. Even see them down here on occasion. Here, they'll only land in the woods, though. Quick, quick! 
Quay, Quay. Black chocobos always remember their way home and return straight there after any journey. They're a very high-strung temperament, though, and will run away the moment they're back home. The Black Chocobo, being a variety of recent discovery, resembling its fair feathered cousins, save for its safe sapel plumage. Hail, travelers, and welcome to Troya. May you find rest and peace and respite within our walls. You wish to speak. You wish to speak of the crystal. Then you need to seek audience with the epochs inside the castle proper. The epochs are solemn servants of the divine. Conduct yourself with the utmost respect in their presence. A survivor of the assault on Damasian was found washed up on the shore. He is recovering within the castle. Edward! The man claimed to be a prince, although that is not something I'm inclined to believe. Troya has never known war. We are a peaceful people. If it came to arms, I'm not sure we'd be able to fully defend ourselves. Troya's sovereignty and independence are safeguarded by her mothers and daughters. Even we soldiers are all women. Baron's aggressions broaden us, yet surely they will not spread this far. Do not speak to me as if I were some common grandmother. I am Troya's Lady Chancellor. The epochs you'll find in the chamber behind us. I may not look like it, but this is actually our battle uniform. It affords little protection, but it provides mobility and it's fashionable. Dance for you? How dare you? I am a shield maiden of the epochs. Not some two-gill two -gill performer. Eight are the epochs and sisters all, stewards of the crystal from times immemorial. We are, rule, we are better ruled by women who know grace and civility than by men with their barbarous ways and love of war. We are, we eight epochs are the, are the rulers of Troya. Our land has always been blessed by the earth crystal bounty, but now the crystal is gone and I fear for our future. You came to speak of the Earth Crystal? Then you came too late, I am afraid. It was stolen by a dark elf, and it now grows weaker by the day. Should you enter the, the Lodestone Cavern to the northeast with any metal weapons or armor, the magnetic field will render you nearly immobile. We cannot give you the Earth Crystal, but we could lend it to you for a time. Of course, you will need to recover it first. Retrieve the crystal for us and we will allow you to borrow it, but we ask that you bring it, but you bring it before us first. 
The Dark 